गुड आफ्टरनून स्टूडेंट्स एज वी हैव कंप्लीटेड द लास्ट लेसन एज आवर फर्स्ट लेसन वी हैव गॉन थ्रू द टेक्स्ट वी हैव रेड एवरी थिंग टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू सम पर्टिकुलर वर्ड्स मीनिंग अनडाउटली आई टोल्ड यू वेन आई वॉज टीचिंग वन आई वॉज एक्सप्लेनिंग लाइन बाय लाइन अगेन आई एम टेलिंग यू meaning of difficult words in this whole lesson and main purpose i'm very clearly stating that as this lesson is over we are going to conduct a spelling bee test and these words will be entertained and you may find the words the meaning written out of box in the box out of the line so first word is dread to be very afraid french was afraid then as of the woods as of the woods as is a corner of a branch corner of a branch as you may see in the photo the sparrow is sitting at the edge of the wood chirping sweet sound of birds chirping sound of birds tempting tempting is attractive tempting is attractive as that prussian soldiers were drilling and their drill was tempting resist resist mean oppose to oppose virodh karna town hall official building for government staff in the town as you may see the photo town hall official building for the government staff in the town next page apprentice apprentice a person who is learning a trade from a skilled employer having agreed to work for a fixed period at low wages or you may say a skill learner skill learner out of breath very fast breathing as it is mentioned in hindi also saans phoolna very fast breathing bustle activity with noise and agitation noise activity here in the school what is expected noise with activities unison unison the action of speaking the same word same word simultaneously as in schools happen child uh, uh, or uh, i told you example when i was explaining it line by line when you come when teacher comes in your class and you say good morning sir welcome sir so all together when you speak that is unison the action of speaking the same word simultaneously or repeating mode rapping strike with a series of rapid audible blows especially in order to attract attention strike on table is also meaning strike on table hit as a teacher does in class 
to have attention of students blushed blushed show shyness embarrassment or shame by becoming red in the face feeling shame or embarrassment next page <clears throat> solemn solemn is serious as everything was serious solemn in the school on that last day primer a primer is a book containing basic fact about a subject which is used by someone who is beginning to study that subject or you may say study notes having basic facts study notes having basic facts grave extremely serious here it stands uh, for the tone of the teacher as in a grave and gentle tone very seriously he speaks <clears throat> thumbed just after primer thumbed having been read often the bearing marks of frequent handling or marks of thumb on a book which is used frequently thunder clap a crash of thunder or you may say a, a sound of electric noise natural electric crash sound of natural electric crash or crash of thunder wretches unhappy people wretches unhappy people nuisance nuisance one that is inconvenient annoying or vexatious a bother mean you may say problem or disturbance or inconvenience this is the meaning inconvenience cranky here it is written satya but you may say short tempered short tempered it is about uh, it has been said about nature nature of m hemal short temper next page <coughs> faithful service a service with devotion adhering firmly and devotedly as to a person cause or idea recite to repeat lessons prepared or memorized recite to repeat lesson prepared or memorized what lesson you have pre prepared or memorized when you speak it again that is called recite reproach to express disapproval or criticism or disappointment reproach disappointment anxious anxious uneasy and apprehensive about an uncertain event or a matter or you may say simple meaning anxious mean worried anxious mean worried when he says your parents were not anxious enough to have you learn next page 
next page fast here fast is not as you say this hold fast to have hold fast on something mean fixed firmly in a place fix firmly in a place pakad bana ke rakhna gazing a steady intent look कंस्टेंट लुक इंटेंट लुक लगातार किसी चीज की तरफ देखना दैट इज कॉल्ड गेजिंग फैंसी सरप्राइज नेक्स्ट एंड लास्ट पेज वॉन बेंच इज हैड बीन वॉन डैमेज बाय wear or use when we start using something continuously after a time uh, there is a damage in the things just a benches up uh, you may say in school uh, sometime we need to repair benches because with the passage of time in may kuch damage hota hai so that is natural da uh, damage by use that is worn twined wind or cause to wind round something this is this word has been used for that hop wind wo bell ke liye use kiya gaya hai jo khidki ke charo taraf lipat jati hai to aapke gharon mein bhi hongi we have in our school also wind mean uske charo taraf lipat jana to wind round something country or you say countryside that is rural area trembled shake involuntarily typically as a result of anxiety excitement or fright mean to tremble mean शेकिंग ऑफ बॉडी एज ए रिजल्ट ऑफ एनजाइटी टेंशन में आके जब आप कांपते हैं दैट इज कॉल्ड ट्रेम्बल ट्रम्पेट्स ट्रम्पेट्स यू मे सी फोटो ऑफ ट्रम्पेट अ मैन इज साउंडिंग विद अ इंस्ट्रूमेंट लाइक अ पाइप दैट इज ट्रम्पेट पेल If someone look pale, their face looks a lighter color, lighter color of skin. That is meaning pale, lighter color of skin. In the last word, vive la France, vive la France, long live France, long live France. So, my dear student, these were the meaning of difficult words. Second time, I've told you. even when we explained it line by line i told meaning of all the difficult words also and again today i have devoted my lecture to difficult words meaning only go through write on your register and very soon you are going to have spelling bee test thank you